Warning, another video of the finer scratch coat in lime ready for the plug coat on this lime plastering job in Olmskirt. Screws left in the wall. Lovely. You can wire outside and mix it. Another batch of water. The important thing is, when you're doing the line work, is to really push it in onto the wall to make it stick. It's not like modern stuff, it's not like putting bonding on or something, but really push it in there, work it in. almost compacting it to the wall. And this is only a scratch coat, so you don't need to be too fussy about getting it that flat. That comes with the next coat, which is the flow coat, and that you get flat, you get it plumb, you get it square. So this, this cottage was built well over 100 years ago and I don't think neatness on the brickwork was in mind when they built it. It's uh, quite irregular in shape.
course, this job's for a young archaeologist who I believe at the moment is working on some uh, Roman line pit that they're excavating. All very interesting. I don't know where, it's in South of England somewhere. Um, 2.5 purely um, because the brickwork is a bit, bit crumbly and a bit weak so it's just to stiffen all that up and then our flow coat will be done with a, a quick line and sand and obviously the, uh, the alignment there in it again This morning, so the van sat in a couple of hours. So we're waiting for that parking ticket to arrive. All the yellow lines are as far as the eye can see.
Pull the top off. In the day when they were doing this originally, they wouldn't have got nice electrical machines for mixing the stuff, a nice refined line, which have all been done by. And the line has been full of all sorts of mulch, bits of sticks, bits of stone. But we didn't care, and that's all we have, so we you. because it's just filled with wine plastic. I don't want to get in the shop on a Friday morning. out now. That's it, that's the last bit. I think the boy's tired. 
Too early start. 6.30 a.m. Yesterday and today. He's not used to that. But then again, neither am I. So I think that's it for now. I'll do a bit more filming later. So we'll call that part two.